Max, can you just describe what a chelate is? Sure. Well, number one, it's a mineral amino acid chelate is a specialty form of mineral that's really a mineral delivery system. And I got this little prop here. Uh, okay. Now, to form the typical Albion chelate, you have two amino acids. We use glycine. If you picture this as a glycine and this is a glycine, right? To form a chelate, they have to come and wrap around the mineral, whether it's iron or magnesium or calcium, in this fashion. And there's special bonding between the, the glycine that's bonded at the amino end and at the, the acid end, right? And they form very specific uh, forms of uh, bond. The important one is called a covalent bond, a corded mm -hmm. covalent bond. And uh, rather than go into all the detail of what that means, it's, it, it, what it does is it gives the chelate a better stability constant, keeps it from falling apart uh, as easily as like ferrous sulfate, you know, a non-chelate form would. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's resp that, actually this stability constant and keeping this together in this way uh, results in giving the chelate a, its advantages over the non-chelate forms. Okay. So basically, the chelate would look like this and stay like this because of the stability constant. And also it's important the size of the molecule, the smaller you can make it the better absorption results sure. typically will be. And uh, that's why glycine is so good because it's the smallest amino acid. So what sort of supplements are most often found in a chelated form? Well, you will find chelates in tablets, in capsules, in uh, ready-to-drink products. It's also found in uh, uh, foods and beverages. Uh, it's got very good what they refer to as organoleptic properties. So you can mix it in the food and it doesn't affect the texture of the food. It has minimal effect on flavor, uh, mm -hmm. things like that. So it's very adaptable to food and beverage as well as tablets, capsules, uh, soft gels, uh, goos. Mm -hmm. Because today uh, they're becoming more and more inventive in terms of how to deliver dietary supplements. And, in particular, the millennials are uh, a group that like buying things that are not tablets and capsules, and sure. they like to go for these new forms. And so, mm -hmm. it's, it's, so it's caused Albion to look at a lot of things uh, about the product. In addition to the chelate itself, we have to look into uh, what particle size range we, we form uh, because the uh, granulometry, as they refer to it, uh, in, is, it needs to be closer together at a smaller size, for instance, when they go to fortify yogurt or things like that. So, mm. you know, the chelate's great, and you have to take into account granulometry because of these new forms for millennials and, and things such as that. Mm.